Hey YouTube, I've got another experiment for us to do today. Today I'm going to be experimenting with carbon removal on this lawnmower. Now I haven't even taken the head off of this engine yet, so I don't know how bad it is, but I've seen water been used to remove carbon. Now I thought, what about something more acidic like vinegar? Well, today we'll give it a shot. be curious to see how much carbon this has on it because since I've got it, which was probably five, six years ago, I've never ever had it apart. But we'll soon find out. Ow! Oh, just kidding. Alright, so I have all the bolts off and let's take a look. Oh, of course, there's a bolt that I didn't see. Oh. Can they not have made this any easier? Okay, well, one more bolt, I guess. So, this is what we have here. Decent amount of hard carbon build up on there. I'll, uh... Fairly decent. We'll see if we can clean it off. Right now I'm just gonna warm up the lawnmower to operating temperature. I've got the head back on and we're gonna try the vinegar. even start it. Uh, maybe. Well, hack. I guess vegetable oil and gas doesn't age well. Turned out to be quite the project. That's the way gas should look. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to start it up and we'll start feeding it vinegar. Too much, I guess. So far I'd say I've probably put about a half a cup in. I'm going to go ahead and add the rest to, I put about a cup and a half in there, so we'll see how it does. 
Okay guys, so I've let the mower hot soak and I ran out the vinegar that was remaining. So now I'm just going to take off the head and see what we got here. See if it worked or not and I'll get back to you when I got it off. So I've taken off the head and it doesn't really appear to have removed any of the carbon but it definitely made it softer. See, I could not wipe that off before I did it. It was very hard, but this way I can just come around and clean it off very easily. So it definitely did something towards the carbon. So yeah, I mean maybe with more it would remove it completely, but it certainly made it one heck of a lot softer. I could probably just wipe that off with a little bit of work with the rag and I don't even think I need a wire brush. So. Yeah, and I'll give you a view of the block of the engine. This stuff is also quite soft. So, I'm actually happy what it did. Maybe with a little more runtime with the engine, it would eventually burn off completely, but who knows? Maybe we'll have to try it. So, I've actually worked at this block, and all I've used is this paper towel to rub it off. Vinegar certainly softened it a great deal. I'll work at this some more and I'll see if I can't get it all off. Not bad, I'll just let that soak. I would definitely say that is much cleaner.